think uh, it's very important to see uh, scholars outside the, the business ethics field to, to bring their ideas to, to this conversation because as we know, Professor Freeman wrote the book in '84 about the new vision about capitalism, the idea of stakeholder being important, not just shareholders. But these conversations uh, remained for 30 years among the, the, the business uh, ethics scholars, huh? and, and some, some exceptions maybe. What I think is important now is to see that within the, the economic theory, uh, in the case of Julie Nelson who wrote this book in 2006, uh, Economics for Humans, and in the case of corporate law, uh, Professor Lynn Stout wrote this book recently in 2012 called The Shareholder Value Myth. They are uh, orthodox economists and, and lawyers who explain from their perspective, from their discipline, why basically Freeman was right, why 30 years ago the idea that uh, companies should not be managed with the aim of profit as the sole uh, goal or the unique purpose it was a bad idea and actually they say it's a wrong idea both conceptually and empirically. So these two contributions I think are, are going to be very important to, to join forces in, in what they, way they say it is a revolution, it's a, it's, a, it's a need of a new paradigm in, in the conversation we have about business and about uh, the purpose of the corporation. We, we, we should stop thinking and teaching as they say in business school and in, in law school that that's the, the only purpose of, of this, that is to maximize profit. This is not what they say uh, good economic theory and good uh, corporate law now tell us. So we should really be happy. I mean, I'm, I'm very happy to hear that uh, what I believe in, what I've been studying, uh, the theory of, of stakeholder uh, from Freeman on, uh, now it's becoming a shared knowledge and a shared theory even among economists and among, among corporate lawyers, so very pleased to, to have this contribution.